harbored a real desire to get uh, kind of back to the land. She grew up not on a farm, but in a farming community uh, among, you know, a very sort of close knit group of people who, you know, kind of really valued, had held some very agrarian values. She, she has Mennonite uh, background, as do I actually. So even though, I mean, neither of us would, would be, um, you know, what you might think of as postcard Mennonites, um, you know, some of those agrarian values and those community values uh, right. you know, have, have really kind of found their way into uh, into subsequent generations, um, even if even if people who are in all other ways kind of very cosmopolitan and very urbane, and that sort of thing. So, I uh, think you know, she she had been really interested in in, in finding a piece of land uh, that you know we could plant ourselves um, for a chunk of our lives, and um, and at the time. I had just started up a creative agency, actually, and and most of our clients were, you know, they they were in the states, and um, and it was really just myself and a and a friend who had who had co-founded it. So we were very flexible. So it was 20 years ago was the right time for us to make a move if a move was ever to be in the offing. 